Do you find it tiresome to always be mentioned as the author of the English patient? No, I, actually, I, I'm, qu I'm quite happy with that. <laughs> you know, I mean, I think I'm proud of that book. So I, um, you know, that's great. You know, that people read or see the film or under hear the story. That's that's fine. Every young author wants to be reviewed in magazines and wants to be read by a lot of people. How do you measure success these days when you write a novel? Well, I think I would rather be a, a very good writer, writer than a famous writer. You know, I, I think um, success is, you know, depend on what you want for yourself. You know, there's, there's a, I think um, um, someone said in America, in America they don't want you to have a career, they want you to have a success. And I think every writer wants to have a career more than a success in some way, you know, unless they just, you know, want a quick, you know, victory. And I think for a writer, they want to see a path that they have taken and they are going towards in, in their work. So it's not just one book, but a series of books that add up to a larger picture. So it's been seven years now since your last novel. Is it? Uh, is it? I think about five. Oh, five? Five yeah. years, I think. Yeah, that's right. Do you, is it, have you been working on this novel for five years? Or is it yes, I, I haven't been. I haven't been partying. You know, I, I, I've been mostly writing. I, but I'm a very slow writer, and I, I and I'm also a obsessive rewriter. You know, I, I kind of write the story. I discover the story in the first or second draft, and then I just rewrite the hell out of the book. You know, I have to go back and take three scenes and make them one, or remove some essential scenes, or realize I have to add another aspect to it. It's like putting more and more varnish on a table, you know, so it has a thickness to it. I read a lot of your poetry when I was a, when I was a teenager, and I can see your poetry in this novel. Do you, do you miss writing poetry and try to get it into the novel? <laughs> well, I think, you know, I, when I first moved from poetry to prose, I was able to do both. You know, I could write poetry with one hand, fiction with the other. And, uh, but now it, it's too difficult. It's, it's, you know, I have to kind of focus on one or the other, you know, and, and um, I don't try and sneak it in, but I think all the principles, the principles of poetry that, you know, a poem tries to be as specific as it can about language and, and exact and, and as minimal. I think those elements of poetry I, I bring to the, the fiction. How does the actual working process differ now from 20 years ago <clears throat> or 30 years ago? The working process is still very much the same for me. I kind of, you know, get up in the morning, go to my office, and I'm, I'm there from about 9.30 till 3 o'clock, 3.30. I don't go out for lunch or anything like that. And that's, that's my day of solitude, you know, and that's, that's, when I'm, that's when I dream. You know, it's like, um, that's a time I invent and go the wrong direction and come back and start again and erase and edit and all those things. You Are know? you able to actually leave the work at that table and go back home, or is it still in your head at night? No, I can pretty well leave it. You know, it's, like I, it's almost like I don't think about the book unless I'm writing. You know, I, I don't plan ahead. I kind of, you know, but that means I do a lot of erasing and rewriting. To what extent do you go back and browse through your old book? If you pass by the bookshelf, you see your mm -hmm. books there, do you ever take it down and browse through it, uh, sit down and read it? You know, I have never read any of my books after they came out. I've never read, so who knows what they're like, you know? Really? <laughs> yeah, it's, it's strange, but I, I don't think I can. It, it'll be, because I probably want to fix them. I can recommend out. them. <laughs> okay, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> but it's, it's uh, you know, it's, it's an odd thing, I can't, I can't do it, you know? Um, I had to write an introduction to the collected works of Brew the Kid, Recently, and the book came out thirty years ago, and they said, "Well, you can read the book and see what you think." And I said, "I'll write the intro I'll write the afterward, but I don't think I can read the book again." You know, it was, yeah, it, it, it's it's just too final uh, to kind of see it that way. My mind, I remember it very well. I remember every every scene or moment probably, but I don't want to kind of witness it myself. <laughs>